Well, Mumia Abu Jamal is getting ready for his appearance this morning in a Philadelphia courtroom. He is appealing his conviction in the murder of a Philadelphia police officer. On De December 9, 1981, Officer Daniel Faulkner was gunned down near 13th and Locust. Abu Jamal, a former Black Panther, was convicted of murdering Faulkner in 1982. He has maintained his innocence, however, arguing that his conviction is based on racism. And as reporter Matt Petrillo is live this morning at the Criminal Justice Center, where Abu Jamal is expected to appear. Matt, good morning. Good morning to you. The widow of Daniel Faulkner, that slain officer, flew from the west coast of Philadelphia last night, and she's worried how the new district attorney here in Philadelphia will handle the case, a case that's seen decades of attempted appeals. They still keep finding loopholes to get him out of prison. It makes the family and I more and more distraught. Officer Faulkner's widow is in Philadelphia this morning telling Eyewitness News overnight she has a message for DA Larry Krasner. She wants Krasner to remember the pain she's endured for more than 37 years after her husband was shot and killed near 13th and Locust, a jury finding Mumia Abu Jamal guilty of murder. He's an evil man. He's a very evil man and he's a murderer and he needs to be kept behind bars. Later today, Krasner is expected to announce his position on the Mumia Abu Jamal case. Krasner has been trying to reform the city's criminal justice system, and has previously said he wants the prison population to decrease. It also comes as Abu Jamal is due in court this morning to try again to reappeal his case. Today, Faulkner hopes Krasner stands with her and the city's law enforcement community. He is the district attorney now, and he's out to protect the survivors of crime, of violent crime, and put the people that have harmed them in prison. Still, Abu Jamal's supporters believe he's innocent and should not be serving life in prison. We recognize that there is no justice in this system at all. Again, Mamiya Abu Jamal's hearing is set for nine this morning here at the Criminal Justice Center. Reporting live in Center City, Matt Petrillo, CBS3 Eyewitness News. All right, Matt, thank you.